In this video, I show you how to set up and sell digital products with System.io that is not a course. Now, if you've tried to do this already, and you've probably noticed that System.io seemingly only gives you the options to sell a course or a course bundle or community access when it comes to digital products. However, you can sell other types of digital products with System.io, such as eBooks or software or audio files and things like that. So in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it. Now, all the resources that I mentioned in this video are gonna be linked in the description below this video, so it's easy for you to find them. Now, let's get into the video and I'll show you how to set this up. So the first thing you're gonna need, of course, to sell a digital product is a digital product sales funnel. Now, if you don't yet have one, then I have a digital product sales funnel yeah, and you can access this via a link in the description below this video. I'll then shoot you an email with the funnel template and you can pull it directly into your account. Now, this is the sales page and the order form for this digital product funnel template. Now, I've put quite a bit of time into setting this up and making sure it includes all the elements that you're gonna need to ensure that your product converts as best as it can for you. And when you download this template from me, you're also gonna receive a step-by-step -step instruction video to show you exactly how to customize this, the look and feel of it to you and your brand, how to remove anything you don't need, and also how to add other sections like upsell and downsell pages if you want to use those as well. Now you can use this digital product funnel template to sell pretty much any type of digital product you want. Just tweak it to fit your product and your message and you'll be good to go. Now this template is fully customizable and you can change any aspect of it that you want. Now, once you pull this digital product funnel template into your account, you'll find it under the funnels tab here. And it's this one here labeled digital products template. Now, once you first pull it in, you might want to change the name of this to, for example, your product name. So to do that, just come to the right hand side, these dot menus come to settings. And now here is where you can rename the funnel template to whatever you want. Now, in order to sell digital products with System.io that are not a course, let me show you how to set up everything in the back end. So if we come to the digital product template or whichever funnel template you're working with, and we need to be on the order form page. And then under the step configuration, we need to scroll down and first under the offer type section here, we need to choose digital product. And now under resources, if we click on the plus button and we from the drop down menu, here lies the problem. So System.io is only giving us the option to sell a course or course bundle or a community. So in order to set up automatic product delivery for other types of digital products like eBooks and software and whatnot, we're gonna be using tags. So the first thing we need to do is come up to the top menu under contacts and go to tags and we need to set up a tag. So first come over to the button in the top right corner that says create. And now here we can create a tag by giving our new tag a name. So in this instance, let's say we're selling an ebook, but this method I'm going to show you works for any other type of digital product you might be selling, like an ebook or software or audio file. It's exactly the same process. So in this example, I'm just going to be saying I'm selling an ebook. So I'm going to call my tag demo ebook tag. I'll put a few stars next to it just so I know exactly which tag this is because I'm not going to use this for anything. I'm going to delete it after. So that just lets me know this is a tag I'm going to delete after this video. Anyway, click save. And now my new tag is at the top of my tags list here. And now we want to head back to our funnel, go into the funnels menu, finding our funnel we're working on, coming to the step of configuration, digital product, resources. And now if I select tag from here, I get a new drop down menu where I can choose which tag and the new tag I've just set up should be listed here and it's right here. Sometimes it takes a minute or two to show up. So if it doesn't appear for you immediately, just refresh your browser and it should show up for you. Select your tag and click save. So now we set up this tag. First of all, when people purchase from you via this order form, System.io is going to assign each of those purchases with this tag. So you know when you look in your System.io account, which customers have bought this product. And secondly, we can now use this tag to set up various automations, such as delivering them automatically the digital product that you're selling to them. Now, if you were selling a course or community access in System.io, then you would set those up under the products tab and you would choose either courses or communities where you would house your course or house your community. However, System.io doesn't seem to give us a place where we can house other types of digital products like eBooks, software, audio files. So the solution to this is to house those products in something like Google Drive or Dropbox. So let's just say with this sales page, I'm selling an ebook and let's just pretend this is my ebook here that I've already uploaded to my Google Drive account. So with that being said, what we want to do now is leverage this tag in order to set up an automatic email that will be sent to the customer upon purchase. And that email will send them a link to this ebook in my Google Drive account where they can access it and download it. And again, this is the same if this was a software or audio file, I could host it in Google Drive or Dropbox and send them the link automatically via email, which is what I'm gonna show you how to do now. So if we head back to our funnel, now we've got our tag set up. 
Next thing we want to do is come back to the top and select this option, Automation Rules. And we need to set up a rule. So I click on Add Rule, and the trigger for the rule is New Sale. So upon New Sale, what do we want to have happen? So we come to these little dots on the right hand side and click on Edit Automation Rule. Now we have this new button appear that says Add Action. Click on Add Action, and the action we want to occur upon sale is send an email. Click on this. And now if you look right here, there's a little plus button here that's so small you can almost miss it. Click on this. And now here is where we can write the email that will be sent to the customer automatically upon purchase with the link for them to download the digital product they just purchased. So I've just written out a short email here. Of course, you'd write something much better than this, but it's just for example. Now here I've put, here is the link to access your purchase. I'm going to hyperlink this to the digital product inside of Google Drive. So I come back to my Google Drive account. Now let's say this is the ebook I've uploaded to Google Drive. Click on this little dots menu and we want to choose this option that says share and click on the first option here that says share. And now here we need to make first sure that general access it's selected anyone with the link. So from this drop down, if it says restricted, then when you send the link to the customer, they won't be able to access the product. So make sure you switch this to anyone with the link and then click on copy link. Now we head back over to our system.io account and hyperlink the text you want to make as your clickable link and then click on the little chain icon and then paste in your link and save. And now your link is set and then you need to scroll down to the bottom and click on save. And then from here, we need to click save rule. Now this rule is all set up. So now once the customer purchased a product from you, they'll automatically be tagged. So you know which customers have bought this particular product. And then under automation rules, that email is automatically going to be sent to them upon purchase. So that's it. That's how you can set up and sell digital products in System.io that is not a course. Now, if you've got value out of this video, then please do like, share and subscribe. It really helps my channel out a lot and I really appreciate it. Now, if you want to know how to set up order bumps in your sales funnel, then this is the next video you'll watch. Or if you want to know how to set up upsell and downsell pages, then watch this video here.